Spoilers for the Blacklist Season 9 finale, titled Marvin Gerald, Conclusion Part 2. If there's a show on TV that can count on offering a final to keep fans in suspense, the Blacklist qualifies. The Season 9 finale has some big stories to play out in under an hour, whether Cooper will go to jail, whether Red will find Marvin before the crew, or even whether Parker's headaches will keep her out of the field, just to name a few. Example. As it turns out, this episode addresses those stories while setting up some new high-stakes stories for season 10 and saying goodbye to two key characters. The good news is that the characters who left don't miss season 10 because they're free, but because the cast decided to move on, their characters had pretty happy endings. Series regulars Amir Arison and Laura Thorne have reportedly been officially removed from the blacklist. Their departure comes a season after longtime Hero and Megan Boone left the show. Thankfully, both characters had less permanent endings in the season 9 finale than Liz gave her in the season 8 finale. Alum decided to take a break from the FBI and had no plans other than to move to a cool place in Brooklyn, where he could ride his bike, enjoy NYC, eat pizza, visit Broadway, and he couldn't cope on his own workgroup stressors. The reference to New York and Broadway may actually be a nod to the actor's decision to leave the blacklist. He landed a role in the Broadway stage adaptation of The Kite Runner, an exciting development for him as an actor, but that doesn't mean he'll be off the blacklist forever. Aram is still alive, so the fans more hope for him can live on too. Arison is one of the longest-running cast members on the show, having been part of the team since the first season. As for Park, she also has an announcement. Her appointment with an FBI neurologist to determine whether her worsening headaches would keep her from playing forever had some unintended consequences. Her headaches got worse because she was pregnant. After a miscarriage due to an attack early in Season 9, the news of her pregnancy, apparently delighted by it, is a great way to end Park's story. It's unclear if her headache will go away and if she can come back.